I created Second Foundation Music because I've gained many years of experience writing and arranging music for media productions, from Harry Potter feature films to scores for English National Ballet, while writing numerous albums for the top production music companies in the business. As a result of my many years of experience in all sectors of the industry, I feel there's a gap in the market for the music that Second Foundation Music aims to produce. Production budgets are being squeezed every year, and as a result, the budget for the music and the scores are also shrinking. Too often we're seeing scores that are produced using either a few musicians or entirely using synths. Very good, Daryl. Let's <coughs> get from 49 to the end, please, just to cover the end one last time. And I think we can move on then. We aim to invest in the creation of high quality recordings using top players that will enable producers to source the music that they need to complement their productions without any risk of cost or time implications. We choose to record the music because we feel it adds to our production values and we enjoy working closely with the talented musicians in the process. Second Foundation Music will stand out from its competitors and it will be the go-to library for high quality, big budget music at production music rates. Because of my experience as a film and TV composer and orchestrator, I have a great deal of empathy and understanding of how music should work to picture. With Second Foundation Music, I wanted to put this experience to good use and create a label that is different from all other production music labels. At the heart of everything we do is a consideration of how the music is going to work to picture and how it's going to be an invaluable resource for the editor or producer. Every track will have a main and alternative versions, as well as alternative mixes. There will also be stems available to allow the producer to be confident that when they choose a track from our catalogue, they will have all of the elements they need to make it work with their picture. In order to set ourselves apart from the competition and to achieve our production goals, we choose to work with a team of engineers and producers, all of whom are very experienced and have a history of mixing, recording, producing and mastering music for film, TV and production music. There are going to be monthly releases to ensure that clients can access new music regularly as well as enabling us to deliver current musical trends immediately to their desktops. Our first eight releases cover the breadth of where we see our catalogue going, ranging from purely orchestral music as featured in our albums Forbidden Passions and Contemporary Classical, all the way through to electroacoustic hybrids like modern hybrid scoring and mangled acoustics. Contemporary Classical is an album that focuses mainly on the positive aspects of contemporary, fresh, modern music. This is so useful for adverts and daytime programming, but also has many other uses. I have worked with most of the top orchestras as an orchestrator and composer, notably the BBC Concert Orchestra, conducting studio recordings and live broadcasts of my music. I want to use this wealth of experience to nurture new talent and Second Foundation Music is a fantastic opportunity to achieve this goal. I am certain Second Foundation Music will be the go-to place to discover the upcoming talent of the future. Accent like um, the other Dun drums mm -hmm. as well. Okay, so this is click from 45, play 46 please, here we go. This venture is something we are really excited about and we can't wait to continue creating these high quality productions for Second Foundation Music. Production budgets are being squeezed. <laughs> are being throttled. I look like I'm grimacing, I'm like, enjoy. <laughs> we aim to invest in the creation of high quality recordings. <laughs> I bet we run out of space. <laughs>
Red lorry, yellow lorry, red lorry, yellow lorry. Mommy, 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 ma. Do I sound too boring? Yes. Uh... What? <laughs> Stop it! <sighs> okay, we're just gonna have to go for one. Are my eyes red? <laughs> because of my experience as a film and TV. <laughs> 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 Something in my throat. I think it's milk. So useful for adverts and daytime programming, but also has many other uses. <laughs> I looked at you and then realised I looked. No, I looked at the camera, so it was a, it was a duff take anyway. And also, I started crying halfway through. And I think that might look a bit weird if they just cut to me. And I just. <laughs> okay, hang on. I need a moment. Ba ba pa